girls, so it's your girl April, and this video is going to be so much fun because it is actually the end of the year, and I'm really excited about doing this video. You guys know that me and my daughter Mumsy did a dollar beauty haul a couple of weeks ago, and this one here, I absolutely love Shop Miss A. I know you guys have heard of it. If you have not, please check them out. I will post a direct link below for you girls, but every single piece of makeup on that website is only one dollar okay one buck you cannot go wrong with just spending a dollar though some things on um the site may not be to your liking i guarantee you the site is huge it has a variety of stuff so there is something there for everyone like seriously there's something there for every single one of us girls okay and if you guys thought that going to the dollar tree is exciting and getting makeup from the dollar tree hunties okay you have never experienced Shop Miss A, where I say everything is a dollar, and they have some pretty amazing makeup. So the actual lip color that I'm wearing today, uh, I, I never do dark, vampy lips. I just don't. Um, it's not that I don't want to, but I just be feeling like some of it don't look good on me. It just doesn't work for me. Sometimes red is a very hard color for me to put on. I'm not really sure why. It takes me like forever to get the red on my lips. I'm not sure if it's because my top lip is thinner. I don't know, but either way, it's so hard for me to put on red. So that's why you guys don't really see me with a lot of dark vampy colors on. But today, honeys, I got this one on right here and it was from Shop Miss A. So first of all, cute bag. Last time I showed you guys the bag was orange. This time it is black and white. And I say this and I mean this. I really wish that they had a store here in Arizona because let me tell y'all, they got one in Texas and if they had a Shop Miss A in Arizona, okay, Arizona, a girl would be there like at least three to four times a week. I'm just saying, okay? Because you don't want to miss out on nothing. Now, first of all, it's kind of like a hint to Shop Miss A. If y'all are watching this, if y'all see this, hint, hint, wink, wink. Could y'all please like branch out? to like Arizona and also New York because you guys know I'm from New York so you know if they were in New York there would be nothing left like on the first day but yes they actually have a storefront and whoever has been there let me know below if you have purchased from Shop Miss A let me know below what do you think of it now I'm gonna tell you this and so you guys don't be let down sometimes when you go on the website some of the items are sold out. So my suggestion would be to make sure you register and that way you'll get updates through their email. And the last time there was a lot of items that were sold out that I wanted, but this time around, it was a hit, hit, hit. So let me start running my mouth and let's get on to this video. I'm kind of really picky about the beauty blender sponges that I get. Normally I only will use Real Techniques, um, the orange sponge, because I have been through plenty of different sponges and that one just seems like it's the softest and the best for me. But hey, I mean, I'm just saying, it's always nice to branch out and see what else they got. So... A diva went ahead and tried this one here, which is by AOA Studio, and this is the latex sponge. Now, this one is black. I like the color because, first of all, even though when you clean it, it won't show up as bad, so that's one thing. Now, this one is pretty soft, so I'm going to give this one a chance. There has been some that I have purchased from, like, the Dollar Tree, and they have actually been really hard from just arrival. So, this one is pretty soft. This packaging, it's really chic. You only pay a dollar for all of this, from the packaging to the sponge. So, I mean, I'm just saying, it's like really, really neat. It looks like a really expensive product. Black always looks chic and expensive. You see how like the expensive brands like MAC and um, Makeup Forever, I think, has black. And I really can't think off the top of my head, but um, Black Ups Cosmetics, their packaging is black. It seems like... Cosmetic companies that use like black are always more high-end are a little bit more expensive. So hey, this one is pink and this one is a little bit different. This one kind of reminds me a lot of my orange one by Real Techniques because the bottom portion right here is flat and actually the flat portion is supposed to be used for underneath the eyes. Now this is what it says for Real Techniques and I'm pretty sure that it would be the same. This is also just as soft. As I loved those beauty masks that I showed you guys in um, a recent video to try the 
tea tree one, which is a really, really good for your skin. Anything with tea in it is good like for your skin, for your hair, kind of like detoxes you. So I wanted to try this one here. And also charcoal masks are like really, really great. So I got two charcoal masks, one for me, one for Mumsy. I have quite a few charcoal masks, but I do like them because for some reason they make my face a little bit more moisturized. Now this one here, I wanted to try this because first of all, I have a salon spa cleansing thing, but it, it works on batteries and that's fine. Sometimes I don't feel like taking it all out the case. It doesn't really take much work to take it out the case and spin it and do all of that stuff. But sometimes it just seems like I have a lazy moment. So I got this one here. This is a facial scrub. It's very soft. It's silicone. And on the back, it has like a little piece of handle or a little thing. And you just basically want to stick your fingers through there. You just hold it like that and just scrub your face, cleanse your face. This is the nail bud, the nail polish holder ring. Okay, so I'm going to tell you guys, I don't really polish a lot, but you, you guys know I got like those that huge box of fake nails that I have purchased and I wanted to try them out and I really like some of them I have that are clear and I wanted to try this I mean I've seen this on like videos and I've seen this on a website and all you do is you take this which is and you take your nail polish and you just sit it in there and you just polish your nails and dip it back and forth I thought it was cool okay it's really cute it is like a silicone rubber and very lightweight it has two rings um, for your finger and it actually doesn't fall out you see that it holds it really really snug so any type of nail polish size will fit just perfectly in here and there are like different colors but for a dollar you know it's cool to try out you just if you love to do nails and you want to try something different then I would highly suggest giving this a try right here the next beauty blender okay so I have had one of these and the last one that I had was so hard I got it from Walgreens super hard I had to soak it for like 24 hours just for it to get a little and that didn't work this one is very soft I've never used one that has like this little shape right here but it is very spongy and it's very soft so this may be um, workable some facial wipes for a buck I'm saying these are 15 facial wipes they're unscented the packaging is chic it kind of reminds me of like the Mac facial wipes okay before a dollar I'm saying. I thought these were cute. Um, these were so cute. So these are makeup bags. You can, I mean, actually you don't have to carry makeup in them. You can put whatever you want in them. But this one says, okay. I know you guys can read that. So this one says, oh, in the S word, okay? You know, I always gotta be extra. Sometimes I gotta be extra. And this one is so cute. Blending is my cardio, okay? What? Listen, they got a whole bunch of different ones on Shop Miss A with a lot of different sayings, and I'm telling you, for a dollar, they're really super cute. Now this, I have one, but I could not find it, and I, I actually have this other product. It's a glove that you put on, and it's rubber, and you just clean your brushes with it, and each side has some different kind of grooves. I was, use, I was using that for a minute, but it started getting too hot. I really didn't like my hands inside of that thing, like my, my entire hand inside of it. I just, so I stopped using it, and then I had one of these, and now I can't find it, and it seemed like it cleaned my makeup brushes a lot better, so I went ahead and got another one this is the cleaning egg it has the ridges right here and these things really do clean your makeup brushes really good they have different ones on the top and then at the bottom and all I do is I run the water warm and I'll put a little bit of back um, antibacterial hand soap into the um, egg and I'll just swish my brushes around and it does get off um, it does get the dirt and the makeup off really really well you guys everything is a dollar on the website every single thing except for this one item but you can still get it for a dollar. Um, this is the PM brushes. This is the 10 essential brushes for a more dramatic look. Now, first of all, let me tell y'all, you can buy these separately. I did show you guys in a last video the brushes. You can buy them separately and you they're a dollar. You can get 10 for $10. It's all the same thing, but they are sold separately. And I will tell you this, for a dollar, that was a really great flat buffer brush. The quality of that brush was so, so good. Look at this. So you can put your highlighter on, girls, and be highlighted to the gods, okay? Like y'all would say. So they got these, and they also have numbers on them. So this is the F17, F14, which is an angled contour brush. Very soft and... I think this would work great. I love makeup brushes. Like I have a lot. So these came right on time. Large powder brush, which is 
amazing. I love brushes this size. I have one that you guys see me use in all my videos, which is purple, and it's by Sonia Kashuk. I love it because it just has the right density in the brush, but this one seems like it'll work just as well. I have seen many different makeup brushes for a dollar, and trust and believe they are not of this quality. 116 angled eyeliner brush, um, eyebrow brush, EE 113, large flat shader brush, E121 soft shading brush and this one of course is a different color another angled brush which is the 114 a flat eyeliner brush and then we have a smudge brush which is more or less like a rubber tip last one inside of here is a retractable lip pencil brush let's get on to the goody good good stuff even though all of this stuff is good i know you guys are like where's the makeup girl we want to see the makeup bring on the makeup so i didn't really get that much makeup this time um i did get some lip glosses or matte lipsticks that i've been wanting that were sold out and i'm so excited because first of all they they put them in these cute bags but this bag is my favorite for some reason even though there's only three in here this is like my favorite one okay. this is the clean color madly matte matte lip gloss let me tell y'all i have had this i got this on this stuff stays on your lips all day on day okay like seriously so this is the 16 the colors are a number so this is 1625 it's like a pretty red kind of dark deep red very very pigmented but they last like they do not come off you see my lips, this is like a couple of hours, okay? Nice color. And this is the 1625. As you girls know, I love those like nude lips, okay? I love this. Girl, I was like going crazy about this one. 1627. The 1626, which is to me like a mauve kind of like brown color. This is the one that I got on my lips, okay? I don't know why I said mauve color because through the thing it looks like that, but it's really not. But I love this color brown. I don't really do a lot of browns, but isn't that pretty? Like, ooh, yes, Ponte's. The Santi brand. And let me tell you, I like the Santi brand. Their eyeliner is amazing. I showed you guys that last week. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna take this off. Um, if you like it came right off but let me tell you something if you allow this to dry because i didn't allow it to dry once you allow it to dry it's really hard to get off i do have like some residue left from earlier as you can see this was like hours ago so if you allow it to dry it takes a little bit of work to get off so for those of you who love the power of lipstick to stay then trust me that one is going to work when i seen this one i was so excited because this one right here unfortunately they don't have colored or names once you remove the labels from the Santi brand you cannot tell which one it is but it's long lasting matte liquid lipstick and it reminds me so much of one of my favorite matte liquid well it wasn't even matte it was a cream liquid lipstick by NYX and it was Abu Dhabi I freaking love that one it is like my new Abu Dhabi but for cheaper price now this one, I did not remove the label, and this one is in the color 01, and it's pink. Very bright, right? I know I just wiped off the Abu Dhabi. Look, I'm calling it Abu Dhabi. I wiped some of it off. It's hard to get off. Very, very bright, but it's very pretty, though, too. Like a, I don't know, burgundy, like a brick color, like a brick house, a brick color. It's still very pretty. Number 05. Or zero five. So this is between a pink and a, a, like a red to me. You know, it's like between a pink and a red, but it's gorgeous though. For some reason, this one, as you can see on the bottom, actually has the number. Out of all of them, this is the only one, and this is zero eight. It goes on so smooth and like velvety, okay? Like velvet, baby, like velvet. Like in the purple family. Now watch, I'm gonna have these swatches on my skin for like days. Another red, this is a little bit brighter than the 08, which is right here. And the sponge applicator is a doe foot. 
So it's a little bit brighter. Um, it's not, I'm, I'm not sure how it is um, appearing on camera, but it's not like a orange red. It's more or less just like a really bright red, just like a red, like a crayon color bright red. And the last one is this one here. This one is a little bit different. This is just actually matte lip gloss, long lasting lip gloss. It says 24 hours. I don't really think I wanna wear anything for 24 hours, but it's the same brand. The tube is different, and this is in the color O2. This one seems like the tube is a little bit bigger. It's called lip gloss. This is pretty. Look at that. That's pretty. Mm. So, yes, you guys, shop Miss A. I will post the link below for you guys so you guys can go and spend all of your hard-earned cash, your Christmas bucks, or what have you, and shop on Shop Miss A where everything is a dollar. If you spend $39 and some change, let's just round it off to $40, you get free shipping. The stuff does not take long to get to you at all. They got eyelashes, human hair eyelashes, like seriously some dramatic, nice eyelashes. They got some really nice eyelashes, individual lashes. The lashes that I actually have on are from Shop Miss A. They have like everything on their website. So keep that in mind that some of the items may be out of stock, but just be patient, buy what you can and always go back. It's always fun to go back. Put that stuff up in your car and get you some free shipping and a bunch of cosmetics. Y'all see how pigmented this stuff is okay very very pigmented very wet wipe and look all right and I'm wiping it takes a minute for this stuff to come off so keep that in mind for a dollar you're getting a great product so I hope you guys enjoyed this stay diva and delicious enjoy your new year I will post the link for you guys below and make sure you rate comment subscribe I love you guys hey. Yeah.